Oh, hey, welcome to day two. Today is staining day. Um, we started off this morning. I went ahead and fine edged the entire job. And as I was doing that, um, Xavier chased me around the house with the orbiter and the scraper blade and scraped all the corners and random orbited all the edges. Now you see him doing it here with a light. He is checking uh, for sanding scratches. Anytime you're staining a floor, um, stained floors show off everything. They're like black cars that show off any little thing. Um, so the sanding has to be perfect. So it's a little extra step we do um, to check. Check the sanding. After it's been all fine edge, before we buff, we make sure and random orbit all the edges and pull all the corners. So when asked what Xavier thought of random orbiting, his response was, and I quote, it's not my favorite. <laughs> so, poor guy, it's a tough job crawling around on your hands and knees all day and doing the corners and all that stuff. Uh, but he did an awesome job today and uh, the sanding was super, super good on this. So once he finished up uh, random orbiting, there was a little clip there of me buffing. Um, I went behind him and buffed and vacuumed and we taped Tape the uh, baseboards off, and then once that was done, it's time to water pop. So you see me doing that here, just with a bucket and some water and a sponge. I know there's easier ways to do this. Um, I just haven't went and bought the a sprayer yet or a pad to do it with. I know a lot of people, you know, get on me in the comments about there's easier ways to do this. Get off your hands and knees. Um, honestly, it, it, this is not a huge floor. It's only about 650 square feet, so it did not take me that long. Um, but got that water popped. Once that was dry, it's time to stain. Um, yesterday, I put the, it out to you in the, in the comments to vote for what color you would pick. Uh, the winning color is English chestnut. That is the color that uh, the homeowner wanted to go with. They wanted those red tones to shine through. So um, English chestnut is the color. So you see Xavier going around the edges here and cutting in with the cutting pad. And... Uh, and then basically I pour a puddle and start spreading it with the buffer. Um, you want to make sure and get it nice and even, nice heavy coating and nice and even. So sorry, I have the, uh, <laughs> that's a long time to be on there, but um, I have the camera hanging from the door. So anytime he was getting behind the door, it was uh, covering the camera. So sorry about that. But um, here we are buffing. Um, this is, I guess, the third bedroom that we did, I believe. Um, kind of buffing in that stain, evening it out, and getting a nice even color. So, uh, very happy to get it stained today. The fact that we're day two and, and getting it stained is pretty awesome. It's not the biggest floor, um, but um, still, it's a good accomplishment, especially, um, you know, getting it all done today. Here, you saw me going into the closet. Again, camera's hanging from the door, so sorry about that. Um, so it's all stained today. That means it'll be dull done tomorrow. So I will start off in the morning um, applying one coat. We'll wait for that to dry. We'll come back, buff it, vacuum it, pull all the tape, clean everything up, and get ready to coat it again. So here's kind of some clips of how it turned out. I'm very pleased with it, and we will see you tomorrow.